A house that's well staged often sells for thousands of dollars more than a house that isn't. So in this video I'll show you three simple things that you can do to your home to make sure that you get as much money as possible. Hi guys, I'm Frank Huff. Staging a house involves way more than just deciding which wall to put your couch up against. The reason that we stage a house is so that a buyer can picture themselves living in your house. The first key to staging a house is making minor repairs. You don't want to have burnt out light bulbs, for example, because a buyer will come in and see that and apply it on a broader scale, and they'll probably assume that you in general don't take very good care of the house. So you want to make sure that you make minor repairs if you can. Next, you'll want to declutter your house as much as possible. You're going to be moving anyway, so go ahead and start packing up some of the things that you don't need and put them in boxes in the garage. You'll want your house to have a nice, clean feel. The last tip, which is very important, is depersonalizing your house. Now remember how we said that we want the buyer to be able to picture themselves living in your house? It's going to be hard for them to do that if there's pictures of your kids and your family hanging on the wall. So as much as you might want those pictures up, you're going to get a lot more money for your house if you take the pictures down because then the buyers can picture themselves living in your house and they'll picture it as their house, not your house. I hope this video has been helpful. Remember that you can watch all my videos online by going to frankhuff.com where you'll get redirected to my YouTube channel. I'm Frank Huff with Edina Realty. Thanks for watching.